everyone, this is Sherry. Today I'm going to introduce our Hello One for all of you. Now let's open the box. This is the printing platform. And this is the printer. This is the power cable. And this is the tour package, and including the data card, brush, and the uh, user manual, and so on inside. And here is is the film for the 3D printer. So this is everything in the box. Now let's connect the power with the cable. This is a 5 inch full view touch screen and it uses Creality self developed operating system. Usually the slicing software on the market is cumbersome. But our 3D printer is equipped with the self-developed slicing software. The interface is very simple and the operation is also very simple. Some of the slicing parameters are customizable, so even if you are a beginner, you can easy to get started in seconds. Our Hello One has a very powerful inner core. It uses our self-developed mainboard. It's a 64 b and 4-core CPU similar to a mobile phone. Can 3D printer also be upgraded online? Sure. Our Hello One can upgrade online just like a mobile phone. It supports new firmware and a new system upgrade online with one click. Our Hello One 3D printer uses integralized source which developed by Creality. Usually it's composed of multiply miniaturized source and each miniaturized source is composed of four light emitting chip and the light source energy uniformity can reach more than 80% and uh, the light source is very uniform. Generally speaking, all lamp beds will age and decay when used for a period of time. All other light source structure cannot avoid this problem. However, our integral light source can ensure that the uniformity of the light source will not be affected when the light source and the individual lamp beds decay and the conversation is provided on the screen so as to ensure normal printing. And now I'll show you how to use this 3D printer. First, let's click settings. And we can see there are many settings. We can click the parameter setting first and check all these settings. You can adjust them according to your requirement. First, let's do the levering. Let's click the Z axis and auto homing. Now let's loosen the hand screw and then put the printing platform into the printer. Now tighten the hand screw. Take out the resin vat. Next, let's use the driver screw to loosen this four screw. It's loosened now. Now let's put one paper on the printing platform and then click levering. Use one hand to press the printing platform 
and use the driver screw to tighten the screw. After tightening four screws, let's auto homing again and take out the paper. The platform plate has been tightened now. Then put the resin vat on the printing platform again and uh, tighten the screw. Let's put the finished model into the U disk and then insert into the 3D printer. Pour the resin into the resin vest. Now let's start printing and let's click file and choose the file you want. Click twice and click star. Let's put on the cover. It stop printing now. Let's check the printing effect after one hour. Now the printing is finished. Let's check the printing effect. Wow, the printing effect is very good and the surface is very smooth. So you can also try to print a model by yourself with a 3D resin printer.